Greetings, vloggers, bloggers, and followers. Dustin here with Dustin's Dynasty. And uh, well, it's been a year. Um, that's what my next vlog is. It's about the new year. Um, well, it's not as much the new year, but reviewing what we've been through in this year. And three words I can say is, oh, what a year. Well, four. Um, I started off the year great. I was almost, you know, I was living independently then. Um, a month into the year, um, something had happened. Um, we had a pest infestation. I had to leave my home at once. Um, was not my fault. It was a combination of other things with the building management, so on and so forth. So, um, I had to move by my parents at, again after being gone for almost a year and a half. Um, I thought I'd be back temporarily. The, and COVID hit. Um, I didn't wasn't able to work because of this pest. And eventually I was able to uh, five weeks down the road. And as soon as that occurred, uh, COVID hit. And we were told to be off for work for, for some more time. Uh, the day program closed for two weeks. Uh, we were sent home with nothing for two weeks. Um, no work, no day program. But they were taking care of us. Um, and eventually we got, we got virtual services back for the day program. But as far as the, um, work, we got to go, we got to work virtual, which was a new thing for everybody. Um, because of my work, I got to, I got to work from home and that was different. Although it was with my parents, it was different. And I was staying in my parents, uh, office for what was there, what would now be my parents office for a while. So it was kind of weird and kind of depressing and kind of sad if you look through it it was a really rough time um i had been off my medication for some time off and on i was playing with it a lot and i know that wasn't healthy and i realize that now you know i realize i'm not well when i don't take it and i realize i don't sleep well and i realize you know i need to take care of myself um when i so that's what i need to do i need to take my medication and that's important um, it's just as, as important, therapy is just as important, thankfully for my therapist, uh, she was on call all the time. I mean, I mean, I flipped out on my parents multiple times. Um, I got, had several meltdowns, uh, caused my mom very, be very angry a lot of times. And, you know, through the grace of God, we got through it and didn't result in law enforcement being involved or being in the hospital. But it was definitely something um, that I don't ever want to do again. And, you know, um, it, was when I, it was when I went days without medication, taking evening medication, that, you know, it was, it was bad. And um, eventually I had to tell the therapist that. And, you know, it was, it was not good. It, it just, it, in the end, it doesn't work. Um, so I don't, you know, just, I knew I, was, I had to realize that I had to stop doing it. Or I was going to lose my relationship with my parents, who I really needed at the time. Um, in June, we got to go back to the day program and work, so that was a little bit of a relief. Not full time, but a staggered schedule, which wasn't bad. And still not bad, still that way uh, to some points. Um, cases were down then, and you know they seem to be going back up now, but you know. It's the course of what the people do. Um, so on, uh, so I, uh, in June, also in June, at the end of the, at, the, at, that, at that same time, I had determined that I would put my notice into my apartment and vacate it, and I did. Um, which officially closed on June 30th. Um, so for the, like, the five months, I didn't even think, I thought, be, I thought if we were speaking here today, I thought we would, I would still be with my family. But uh, that changed, and on um, and on October th in the October the end of October, I got a call from the people who manage this apartment I'm in now uh, about coming down about coming down in for an interview and touring, and seeing if I was a good fit. Um, they loved me. They had we had a wonderful tour. We had a lot of discussion about the last experiences, so on and so forth, and um, I had uh, accepted the apartment and moved in here i moved in here in november and i've been here since november granted the cases uh the covid cases have gone up they've risen but um luckily i've not been been affected in any way 
count my lucky stars and on this particle board desk here um that it's been fine but uh you know it's it's you know it's gonna be a good year so yeah it's different uh, christmas thanksgiving i i did spend halloween i did spend passing out treats at my sister's but the last time i saw i actually physically saw her in person uh well no i take it back it was the one time i was really close then um come around so we spent a couple of weeks and then thanksgiving i didn't we didn't have a meal or anything like pretty much like today although my my mobile psych worker brought a meal and there was a thing in the community that had um did things for the people who needed it so i got a meal from them so i was well fed on thanksgiving and christmas um so the after thanksgiving the cases had went up uh substantially um in our area so we've been stuck cut back in services again been more of a virtual presence um working remotely as of right now who knows what the future in 2021 is going to tell us uh it's all about how the number of cases uh are um brought down and the numbers you know how they how the numbers <coughs> excuse me are working with us um you know determines if we'll be back so yep that's my year it was my year and i hope for a better year i hope for a year with no problems i hope to be a little more healthier do do a little more you know things um be out no more enjoy things a little more than what i've been um i've been really seclusive to being in here and not living here a lot um it's been really different it's a really different um kind of year um i don't want to be like that anymore i want to go out and i want to walk and i want to explore the beautiful city that i live in and um you know just get back to normal you know um i haven't been to a i have my weight loss shirt on i have been there i haven't been there since july so you know i just want things to be normal and um you know they're not going to be as long as people don't do their part but we all got to be in this together people that's what I'm going to close out with. We got to be out in this together and do our part, wear our masks, physical distance. Um, I hate to sound like, you know, a socialist Nazi, but, you know, it's, it's the truth. Um, we got, you know, we got to do our part and we got to, you know, do our part to protect our neighbors and to protect ourselves so that we can get a better 2021 ahead of us. Thank you. Um, that's Dustin's Dynasty. Follow us on Instagram, Facebook, Twitter, and YouTube. Um, like, follow, and subscribe as always. Thank you. Have a Merry Christmas as this is Christmas and any other holiday we'll be celebrating here in the week. Thank you.